let's have you on a start off face down like always. And again, I'm just gonna walk you through everything we're doing. Cool. I need a nap. So that's what happens when people get their self, um, themselves face down on this yeah. table. They start to become lazy and <laughs> uncoordinated too. <laughs> Me included. I don't know what chiropractic tables do, but that's just what ends up happening. Julia's main complaint was in her low back when, first, uh, when she first started coming in. I always start with the pelvis and low back anyways, since that's our foundation. And then I start to work my way up. So first thing we'll do is we'll check leg length down here. So today we're looking slightly shorter on that right side. Yep, and then it gets even. And then how are we feeling when I do this? Any uh, pinching or feel okay? It feels good. Feels good? Yeah, okay. I'm not uncomfortable. Okay, good. Yeah, and then L4 even. And you were even saying your knees were bothering you too, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So L4, the nerve that comes out of there, actually goes down to the knees. Oh. So if we correct that, because it is shifted over to the left, if we help bring that back over to the right, those nerves can start to work better, and it will actually help with the recovery process and the performance process for your knees. Cool. So two birds with one stone. This right is a good there. one. This is this is the whole reason why she came in in the first place. Oh yeah. So let's have a uh, bend this leg. Cool. And then I'll see that a little bit more. Nice, nice. And you already know the deal. That's actually bring your hips a little closer. Cool. I always feel like I'm gonna fall off. Yeah, and you guess what? You're never gonna <laughs> fall. <laughs> Should have had the camera on the other side to see your face and on I'll that one. <laughs> so this one I'm gonna get right on L4. Yeah, nice, right there, good. Good, and then the ilium right there. Perfect. And then, and then this one's for the sacrum, or that triangle bone that's in the middle. So the top leg bend. So I can't even move like a normal person. Yeah, you've been lifting a lot of weights, but you're in the, the cutting phase right now too, yeah. right? Yeah. Let's see right here. Cool. Nice. I'm just gonna lower that sacrum. Perfect. Ooh. Let's have you go face down again. It's almost as if she's like living on the top floor of a building or something with the amount of stairs. You can never get to the top. <laughs> I'm always walking. So now the legs are even, so that's good. Staying even. And that's even a little smoother. Cool. Okay. Nice, and let's see how the rest of the spine's looking. Nice. Let's see. Cool. Alpha Lee, that's the gym that's in Houston, right? Yeah, I was yeah. there today. Oh, you, you were in Houston today? Mm -hmm. Oh, geez, okay. Three hour drive. I yeah. see. Yeah. And then all the way out. <laughs> yes, perfect. That's the best one. Yeah. You've been sitting in the car, huh? Yeah, <laughs> right I get so bored. Cool, and then right there. Nice. And relax your head. I'm just going to bring your head over this way. Oh, you can actually leave it face down. Yeah, I'm going to bring it over this way. There we go. There it goes. Perfect. Nice. And let's have you turn over so your face up, please. Yeah. Okay. And then, Good night. So the thing is, if you ever have anything going on in the low back, a lot of times it's something that's also correlated with your neck. Got just a little bit at C2, but mainly at C1 right there. So if you keep your head nice and relaxed, I'm just going to bring it over to the side. Beautiful. Good. And then, yeah, C2 right there. Oh, that's perfect. Good. And then a little decompression like this. This is usually everyone's favorite, just like that. <laughs> there we go. Beautiful. So let's have you sit up and face the doorway for me. There you go. Yeah, no falling. Remember, I said that people get lazy when they get on this thing. And then let's see. So let me have you sit up nice and straight, shoulder blades back. And the reason why she's good at this is because she's always posing in the mirror, right? Yeah. Nice. And this is just basically helping to teach her brain to hold this alignment as long as possible. So that way she can actually start coming in less and less and less because her body's actually maintaining proper alignment. 
tell all the viewers anything about you know your experiences out here, what would you be telling them, especially if they've never experienced chiropractic before? I would say if you've never experienced it, it's kind of scary, you know, putting your health in someone else's hands. Mm -hmm. And especially if you don't know what's actually going into it. So the one thing that was really different about here than previous experiences is that he actually explains what he's doing, why he's doing it, and how it's going to help me. Mm -hmm. And that's an experience I have never gotten before. I was just like, I'm going in, yeah. crack this, do this, bye. Mm -hmm. But it's cool to see him do something and say, okay, well, this is going to help this. And if you're... If you don't even have to be a bodybuilder, but if you're doing any type of weightlifting, anything that is strenuous on your body, it is really important to recover. Honestly, not bad at all with the leg length. Maybe a millimeter short on the left, okay. but that's actually, that's really close. Let me know if there's any pain or tenderness with this, okay? That's okay. That is okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I'm gonna start right up top here. Ooh. There we go. Take a deep breath in and out. Take a deep breath in and out. All right, one more time. Deep breath in and out. in the sacrum. I want you to raise your right leg up for me. Any pain with that? It just feels, um, not pain, but it feels like it's hard to put it up. Okay, relax that side. Compare it to your left side. No, How? Much easier. Much easier, okay. Okay, and then cross your right foot over your left foot. Raise that leg up again. Yeah. How did that feel? That feels much better. And then yeah, just have this leg nice and relaxed. It's good. Just a little bit. Good. And then, yeah, let your arms relax. You just you. relax my legs? Yeah, yep. Mm. Oh! Woo! And rest.
What did you feel? A ton of release. <laughs> <laughs> What I I feel like that's what I've been missing, like all right here. <laughs> Come on. Oh. Relax. Much better. <laughs> I don't even feel achy or anything. Good. Good, because I know actually you've been picking over things. Yeah, neck, shoulders, upper back, and that low back and hips. Mm-hmm. How's it all feeling? I feel 